Good evening, everybody. Thanks for tuning in to Dumb Mind TV. Make sure you hit that like and subscribe button for brand new content. This your boy Gold Mouth Shorty. Let me get straight down to business. Man, they say that boy game, man. He bitter, man. He angry. He mad that he ain't go on the Super Bowl halftime show. And now he calling out Eminem. He challenging Eminem to a battle. They was once labor mates. You know what I'm saying? Both of them got, got put on by the same person. Both of them was protégés of Dr. Dre. And the game broke right now. You know what I'm saying? His account say negative seven million and ninety nine dollars. Because Wack One Hundred got all his money and now he trying to uh get in the tabloids and get some headlines, man. He wanna go after Eminem. You know what I'm saying? He said the white boy, he wanna uh punch him in the ribs and distort him and rob him and and bully him. Because you know what I'm saying? He say, man, I'm better than that white boy. Yeah, he's one of the dopest MCs, but he ain't no great. He ain't no pioneer. He ain't in my top five. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, he kind of got a point. But if you ask me, it's all about album sales, man. So with album sales, you know, you have to give it to Eminem, but as far as, you know what I'm saying, just making good content, a whole bunch of people can smash uh, Eminem in the verses. Lil Wayne can. Uh, Andre Three Stites can. You know, it's all about your catalog, man. You know what I'm saying? You got better songs than him, of course you can do it. We saw it happen plenty of times when people got good beats and stuff. And, you know, they got more records that the uh, the crowds can vibe to. They'll win the versus battle, man. You know what I'm saying? As long as you make good quality music and you got a good sound, good beat. You know, Eminem don't really got no songs like that. You know, he got like five good songs that you can throw on that'll kill anything that Game made. But Game got uh, a lot of good songs with a lot of good beats and stuff so you know you'll be vibing off game stuff you know what i'm saying all 20 songs because you know his beat selection was real good at the time but he said man he'll body that boy eminem man no disrespect to d12 you know what i'm saying but he say y'all can all come together man he'll body that thing and you know what I'm saying? Only person he'll have problems with, he said, is Royce Fine You know what I'm saying? But Eminem, he's straight body in that boy, man. You know what I'm saying? And I believe, I believe him. You know what I'm saying? I believe the best music that game put out, he ain't even gave it to you yet. I believe his best song ain't even came out the archive yet. You know what I'm saying? Truth be told. I believe game got. 15 more years in this game, man. You know what I'm saying? When he figure out his money situation, if he can just pay this money off, he can get ahead and, you know, uh, get back making his cheese like he want to. It's just bills and debts that he don't want to drop. We don't want to pay seven million to nobody. A little sexual assault, sexual allegation charge. You know what I'm saying? He got to appeal that. And get that shit broke down to like two, three million. You know what I'm saying? But hey, that's the only thing halting his career. But Eminem, man, he pretty much washed up, man. You know, he done been in drug rehabs and shit like that. And, you know, trying to bounce back, man. Eminem, he's a lyricist, but man, he ain't fucking with these young cats, man. You know what I'm saying? The game done changed so much. Even though he like a a little Wayne, it's like, where will your bars fit in at? You know what I'm saying? The best thing them niggas can do to get they self popping is jumping on people's features like Jay-Z and shit. You know what I'm saying? But, yeah. The game called them out. Game want their head up, too. You know what I'm saying? So, game say, hey, off the record, nigga, off the record, nigga. I want a fade, too. So after we battle, nigga, I want a one-on-one. -on -one. I want a one. Shoot me the one. He ain't gonna fuck with Dre. He's scared of Dre because 
Dre is the mastermind. You know what I'm saying? He wanted to be down with Dre, so he just felt like, man, Dre forgot about him, man. Y'all forgot about game, man. But really, game uh, affiliation with his management, man, you know what I'm saying? Uh, Dr. Dre didn't want to be fooled up with Wack 100 and having that clown hanging around, man. They already got rid of Suge Knight. So what you think they want a Wack 100 running around, running his mouth up? You know what I'm saying? So this oil and, oil and water don't mix, man. But, yeah, I don't see uh, the game getting a versus with uh, Eminem. It might be Eminem and 50 Cent, but you know what I'm saying? The game ain't going to be in there no well. You know what I'm saying? I don't know who the game can battle. He probably can battle Mac 10 or something. You know what I'm saying? But he definitely can't battle Eminem because they won't let him. They'll put somebody else to go battle him, like Lil Wayne or something. You know what I'm saying? Because Truth be told, the game ain't nobody's favorite rapper either. But Eminem, some people's favorite rapper, but the game ain't nobody's favorite rapper. You know what I'm saying? He's not in the top five at all. But let me just uh, end this video right now, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments about this game versus... Eminem versus in the battle and the beef. Peace of mind.